clean of a break. It's fine. Um, anyway, in the last trailer video you seen we were working on flipping the axle and we we're uh, bracing this up and uh, well, I ended up in the hospital with the wife and uh, grandpa went and he did some welding here to try and stiffen that up a little bit. Um, so that actually I didn't get done and I didn't get any video of it but now we're gonna do the wiring today me and cameraman Dan he's working on breaking the lights off breaking the nuts and bolts apart it's easy yeah, because I got all new lights for it because when I did this oh five years ago I think I remember helping you with fishing line running it all the way down yeah that was a hell of a job but anyway, we'll uh, get some video of this and then uh, enjoy what you see. Ow. And enjoy Dan and hurting himself. Yeah, that's only worth a mile. Okay, Danny, where are we at? We got that one mounted and wired. I just got to put the slings on. Yeah, we got the wires ran through here, through a piece of conduit there. Did some welding. I got that tore apart still because we got that light installed and we got a protector and weld it on there so that the rocks don't break it. Like that one down there was set up the same. But otherwise, everything's ran through. The zip tied on this half. We just got to flip it around for the next side. Right Dan? Yep. Alrighty. After I finish with this line. And on the next side we'll get some more some more video.
Well, now we're done. Last thing you've seen where we were welding these on. But those lights work. These lights back here work now. That light works. And so does that one. So finally all the lights work. That's uh, a good thing. Yeah, I think this is the first time since I've owned this trailer that all the lights work. That's because I went through all the wiring on it now. And I also replaced all the light fixtures on it. Everything. So now all I gotta do is get that mess fixed. Yeah. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.